Now that the uh, top eye line has dried, look up please, we're gonna work on the bottom a little bit. And we're definitely gonna work along the wet line. This is a deep navy blue. And what we're going to do is going to extend this bottom eye line so that it meets the top eye line. And we're just making her, it's, it's like a semi-Egyptian eye. We're just gonna connect that outer corner a little bit, then blend that line in. So it connects right here to the bottom of the liquid liner on top, close please. And then draw some of this pencil over the top of that liquid liner as well so it incorporates it a little bit. And this way, this all seems like one unit. And open please, and you get that nice strong corner of the eye. Turn towards me please, look up. And same thing on this side, we're going to first draw on the interior or what they call the wet line of the eye. I find by just gently pushing in on the underside of the eye, it exposes that part of your eye very easily. And then we're also gonna connect the outer corner here to the top eye line. Sometimes I call this capping the eye, but this is a little bit more of a dramatic cap that we're putting on the corner and connecting to the top eye line. Close, please. So we're connecting it to the top here and then kind of filling in over that liquid liner that we already did this way. It creates like a little V, open please. So now the two become one, slightly Egyptian. And in the night light, this really pops really, really well. And then this little bit of liner right here, you can have a little bit of fun with. Just take your finger and just kind of smudge it a little bit. So it's a slightly smoky, smoldery look on the eye. You don't need a lot of makeup to create this effect. Let the eyeliner warm up on your skin a little bit. Then with your finger, let me get my pencil out of the way. With my, with my finger, I can just smudge that liner. I get that nice kind of creamy, worn effect, which is what you want to go for with this look. So you got some brightness going on up above, a little bit of sultriness underneath. Boom, and there you go. Bottom eyeliner with a dramatic eye. If you're watching this at MakeupGourmet.com, I've listed my current favorite products to achieve this look. Click on one and try it. If you're not at MakeupGourmet.com, go there now to see my favorite product picks for this look, as well as everything else we have to offer. How to apply, what to buy. MakeupGourmet.com